with uh, New Munster head coach uh, Gareth Prendergast. Gareth, uh, you must be happy uh, two bonus point wins to kick off this new competition. Yeah, it's a great start, Cullum. Um, again, good game today. You know, credit to Crescent. I don't think the scoreline reflects the game. They they stuck at it right through to the end. Um, I don't want to sound patronising saying that. That's genuine. They were they gave us a right good battle. So. Um, well done to them. But yeah, very happy, quite clinical at times we needed to be. Got off to a great start, a couple of early tries, and I suppose that set the platform for the game. So um, delighted overall, yeah. And, you know, your pack, your mall was something that, that proved a very potent weapon on the day, didn't it? Yeah, we have, we've, we've worked hard on our set piece, particularly pre season, and credit to Ger Slattery and to Ger Burke and the work they've done there. So our scrum was quite dominant today, and um, we're quite pleased with that. So yeah, it was a really good platform to play from. And you, you, you continue to be clinically brought players in off the bench obviously and they added energy and I'm sure they're you know, um, knocking your door down to try and get the game time as much as anybody else. Yeah, it's like anything, uh, you know, you want you want that competition in every place, so we've, we have that at the moment, thankfully. Um, and a credit to the boys that came off the bench, did a big impact today, so I'm really happy with that. Um, as I said, without that competition, it's, it, it makes things more challenging, so uh, yeah, really happy. A couple of bangs and knocks, so hopefully we'll address that during the week and uh, lead into next week. That's it, isn't it? The game's come thick and fast and back, back on the pitch again next week for another important game. Yeah, we've, been, we've built up a string of games now, which is good. Um, but yeah, as, you know, big challenge next week against Gary Owen, or a top quality side as we know, so uh, it's going to be quite a physical encounter, I'm sure. Um, but one we're looking forward to. Obviously, we've seen a number of games, unfortunately, had to be cancelled in the competition last weekend and this weekend, Garrod. Mm. I presume it's just a matter of taking it week by week and, you know, there's a, there's a bigger picture out there, obviously, with, with COVID-19. There is a course, and uh, absolutely, there has been for some time now. Um, yeah, I've seen today nationally there's been a few games cancelled, but look, the protocols are there and they're there for a reason, and, and rightly so. And credit to the RFU, they're doing a very good job on that. So if there's any doubts, there's no point in risking it. Um, luckily, we haven't been affected so far, but fingers crossed that that, that continues so uh, we get to play our rugby and enjoy it. Maybe a few players waiting in the wings coming back from injuries, just going to. Strengthen your squad and thinking maybe Ben Betts there. Somebody. Yeah, we have a few lads uh, to come back into it. Ben is one, definitely. Um, not a, we're not quite sure on the timeline on those guys, but not far. Um, whether it's next week or not, we don't know, but we'll we'll wait and see. But uh, yeah, looking forward to getting those guys back. We'll add to that competition I spoke about. Somebody like uh, Evan Hughes, I can tell, um, he's really settled into the role well, hasn't he? He's a playmaker, he's goal kicking. You know, he's a he's a very exciting player. Yeah, he's, 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 we're very lucky, I mean, to have, a, to have players of the calibre of, of Evan. Uh, he's very composed on the ball, has time on the ball, um, very good skill set uh, and a very good decision maker as well. Does the right things. I thought even last week against UCC, kicked very accurately and again today. Um, yeah, we're, we're very lucky to have him and, uh, and he's very easy to work with. Uh, loves his rugby. Uh, I think that comes through. He's always got a smile on his face, so uh, delighted for him today. schools with St Munchens, he's, uh, he's settling in well and stepping up well to this, this level of rugby. Yeah, Dunnick has been fantastic, he's been a revelation, he's such a young kid and uh, he's playing with a real maturity. Uh, credit to Charlie today as well, I have to mention Charlie, it's had a fantastic game, game today, so we're very lucky to have two nines of that calibre, you know, and obviously Jack Lyons is there as well, so um, again, goes back to that competition point, but you need a squad with the games that are coming and the physicality of games today, you need that broad squad.